Uh, after a game, um, usually just relax, really, take it easy. I like to go and see my family, um, first and foremost, and catch up with them and um, yeah, go and, go and speak to them because um, obviously they support you and, and, and made a lot of sacrifices. So spend a, spend a fair bit of time with the family and then maybe go, uh, go out for some food with the lads, chill out, have a few drinks and uh, yeah, just switch off and rugby for a bit. Personally, I'd probably say Johnny Leota, um, only because when we played Samoa in the autumn one year, he absolutely smashed me about three times. So, um, obviously playing against Samoa, they're always pretty physical, but yeah, I can remember him standing out for sure. Um, I love being out on the field, ball in my hand, um, actual rugby training. Um, probably the more I dis uh, the things I dislike more is probably uh, being in the in the gym. I still enjoy it and I still think it's really important. But if I had to say one or the other, I'd prefer being out on the field with the ball in my hand. Um, I grew up playing rugby league, so rugby hero was um, Paul Schoolthorpe. Used to play for St Helens. Um, from a rugby league point of view, then as soon as I started playing rugby union, um, I used to love watching. Uh, obviously Johnny play, Johnny Wilkinson and Matt Gitto, there's two tens, two attack, uh, especially Matt attacking ten and see the way they played was, was really fascinating. Jason Robinson, um, I just love to play with someone who's that dangerous and electric on the wing and who can create something out of nothing and finish a try off like he did. Stay humble, keep your feet on the ground. Um, no matter how well you play, how well you train, there's always room for improvement. So, um, yeah, just to keep keep that mindset of getting better every day when you go and train.